Holy sh <laughs> Oh my god. Holy sh ah. <laughs> That was the very last thing that I was expecting. <laughs> Alfonso, this is Optimus Prime. Transform and roll out. What's up, Alfonso Nation? Welcome back, everybody in here, out there, everywhere, from sea to shining sea. It is your boy, Alfonso Peterman. Welcome, everyone, to another episode of Teletran Toy Hunt. It is on and popping, and there is no stopping. Transformers Rise of the Beasts, two months away. Holy freaking crap. We are kicking off more toy hunts officially in response to the breaking news that is happening worldwide, pretty much nationwide as well. And that is the Transformers Rise of the Beasts figures are pouring out. We got Mainline pouring out. We even have some Studio Series pouring out. Studio Series Scourges showing up places. We got the Mainline Deluxes and Voyagers showing up places. We got big, beautiful displays for retail for Rise of the Beasts officially being put up all across the country so that brings the motivation to return to the hunt so hope you guys are ready to buckle in strap up grab your snacks and ready for the ride let's do another toy hunt baby and our first stop is gonna be the one and only walmart let's roll what is <laughs> oh i'm light it now i we are at walmart the the wall of mart the mart where they sell walls because we have to build a wall and that wall is gonna be named Mart or actually Martin or something of that nature. I, I really don't know what I'm saying, but we are here. I don't like come to Walmart at all. <laughs> so it's like, I never actually know what's happening, like what, what, what it's like in there until it's time to toy hunt. And that's what we're here for. Uh, the Rise of the Beasts figures have officially hit shelves like officially in life itself it's officially happening and it's all over the u.s i don't know if it's gonna like actually make it here as fast as it has made it to other places and holy crap the standees the rise of the beast standees are freaking happening like y'all we are two months away two from rise of the beast like from the movie actually dropping not from the trailer. No, not 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 from the figures. From the movie itself. Insanity. I don't know I honestly I don't know if we're gonna see any Rise of the Beast stuff today. It is fairly early. Now some places in my town is pretty good with distribution. So like when things first drop, we might get them. We've seen that before. So we're gonna only hit retail stores, so no toy room today, because retail stores actually receive new releases sometimes on schedule so i room he's not gonna have it until further into the time when it's already released i'm excited let's go in ladies and gents let's get a new hunt going drop a like if you want more of these because i sense more of these on the horizon I know the standees are starting to show up, but I don't think they're here yet. But we are two months from the movie, so we might find at least one Rise of the Beast figure. If I could just find just one Rise of the Beast figure, I'm good. Because, like, I don't know if that entire line has hit this, the shelves yet. I'm so... I, I've, it's been so long, I don't know where to go. <laughs> I'm actually physically lost. Let, I think it's here. I think it's here. Oh my goodness, let's go! Hey, yo, this Walmart's popping. <laughs> a lot of stuff already, like, right off the bat. Um, so, where do I start? I'll just give y'all a wide first, and then we're gonna kind of, like, dive in. I'm already kind of, like, super happy, though. Got a lot of these guys, a freaking ton of them. I actually got partnered with them, the Yumi designers, so pretty awesome. Shout out to them. Um, but, oh, my God! <laughs> Let's go, we got a new studio series. It's the first time I think I've seen him in store. First time on the hunt. Let's go. Just don't expect any bedtime stories. Crosshairs. Ladies and gentlemen, freaking crosshairs. He's the my he's my least favorite of like the releases of that particular 
announcement batch, but looking at him in person, he's actually not terrible. Not as bad as I had thought. I think the render, you see the render looks different than in person. I don't know, I'm digging him. Freaking crosshairs. We've got Ratchet for Bumblebee movie, always good to see. Freaking cool. Then we've got RC back there for 86 line. We've got Coronation Tall Scream. Your mom is bad comedy. <laughs> A lot of Earth Spark stuff. Got Bumblebee. Do we have Optimus? Because I think I might cop Optimus. Like, I am under the impression that Optimus might be worth it. So you got Twitch, Megatron, and B. No Optimus yet, but he might show up. I know he's fairly. He's the newer one of all of these so far, I think. You've got skids, more skids, more skids. So a lot of Earth Spark, good to see them. And you've got some of the other different types of, you know, like one step flip and all of those. Got some core class right there for Legacy. Uh, G Axis, right there. Got Blitzwing, Gabatron. I don't see any other Studio Series leader class besides Coronation. And that looks like that's the case across the board. It looks like that's pretty much it. No Fallen, which I honestly, I'm not surprised. <laughs> He's not gonna last on the shelves. At least, I don't think he would. Um, another Crosshairs here, so that's fun to see. Very damaged, very problematic. So we got these guys for Deluxe, Crosshairs, two of those, and we've got this guy, Junk Heap. Another destroy. I mean, just ugh. I hate that. <laughs> Transformers in the wild getting beat out here. Uh, then we got some of the plushies. Cool, 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 cool. And that's about it. We got this guy here as well. This is one of those like classic. Um, we got the Air Commander Starscream. We got somebody blowing a horn. <laughs> yep, of course. But uh. All right, fantastic. Okay, <laughs> they're not gonna stop. That's what I've concluded. So there you go. I'm digging it. I like this. I like to see a full transformer section and a variety. You know, you got the smaller guys if you don't want to spend too much money. You got the deluxes if you kind of want to spend a little bit, but you want to stick with deluxe. Voyager if you want to go a little harder. Later class if you just want to go like like if you just like if you're just ready to spend. You know what I'm saying? So they got that. Just making sure that there's no Transformers lurking in the distance. Because sometimes people don't put things back where they belong. So there's a possibility that there might be some bots that are stranded from their home. That looks like it. Not seeing too much. Else besides that. I don't know. It's just good to see figures on the shelves. Even if it's not specifically what i'm looking for I, I can't wait for the freaking end cap or the standee for rise of the beasts to show up because it's gonna show up and i am not prepared for it to show up ladies and gents man you know what i'm honestly super satisfied with that first stop like i'm glad that we got a really good selection in the first stop i wasn't expecting to see some of those figures some of them i have not seen in stores yet up until this particular stop so that was awesome seeing studio series crosshairs 92 that's freaking cool and also seeing all of the earth spark deluxes good to see that they have a lot of like variety you know even though i'm not particularly getting all of them it's good to see that they're there so overall really good stuff i'm pretty satisfied i think it was really awesome and it's a really good sign of what else we could potentially find in this city so we're heading to the next walmart but before we do there was something that i just had to do so let's do a little something special in the meantime all right guys so real quick this is not really part of the toy hunt but i want to do this i've actually been wanting to do this for a couple of days now but i just haven't had the time to i said so why oh, i'm out i'm out as well get it Done. So I am pulling up to the cinema right now and I want to see if there is a poster for Transformers Rise of the Beasts. I have yet to see the full scale poster at a cinema. I've never seen the poster in person. I've seen like the digital art, but I know a lot of cinemas have them pretty much showing up all over the place. 
Uh, so I want to see if they are here and if they are I'm gonna be so happy because I want to look at it and I haven't seen a Transformers movie poster at a freaking cinema in over four or five years like oh my god I just want to see if it's here and I want to look at it and enjoy it for a few moments before we hit our next door I'm actually at the cinema now and I think the coming soon posters are inside and the now playing posters are outside at this one now I know they have the big beautiful sexy standee but I don't think this place is gonna have it this theater doesn't have the standees I'm not seeing it uh, that's the now playing I'm not seeing it there yeah they normally show the now playing outside but the coming soon ones is inside I really hope it's in there knockout Knockout! <laughs> this is not gonna be the cinema that I watch Transformers in. I'm gonna have to travel for that because I want an IMAX theater. So, we'll see. Nice. I'm just here to see if there's a Transformers poster somewhere. The coming, yes, thank you. That's all I need, that's all I need. Oh my God, I am not okay right now. This is real life, you guys. Oh, oh, oh. Transformers Rise of the Beast, dude. Oh. They got Primal. They have to give me this poster. They are not tossing this, I need the manager. Yo, it's really sinking in. Like I'm inside of a movie theater and I'm looking at what I always would look at, coming soon posters. But this time, it's our franchise. We're back, guys. We're freaking back. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh. Like a part, a small, a very small part of me wants to tear up but most of me is trying to not do that. <laughs> I'm gonna definitely remember, I'm gonna ask the manager if I can have this. <laughs> Cause I know they throw this stuff away. They just unlock the thing, it's a poster, they put the backlight on it so it can light up. Oh my God. I saw what I wanted to see. We continue the hunt, holy crap. Holy crap, oh my God. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and your mom, I am here at Walmart 2, part 2, sequel, Walmart the sequel, and I don't know what to expect, but this is the store that has a lot of stuff, but not all the new stuff. This is the one that's really far out from where civilization is, so they normally have a lot of stuff to offer, but I have seen since the last hunt when we did this one that they actually had some new stuff, so maybe that is changing, maybe that trend is changing. This entire store is being remodeled too, which I find interesting. So maybe they're actually trying to change their lives. <laughs> so let's go see if there is some Rise of the Beast stuff here. And uh, this will be the last Walmart we go to for today. But I'm hyped, y'all. I'm hyped. Because I know Rise of the Beast is about to hit the shelves in this town. I just don't know when. So let's get the hunt started. Let's roll! Alright, so real quick. We might find something. I don't know. They have moved the toy section. They're remodeling stuff. Oh. <laughs> Holy...
what the no way what <laughs> I can't I can't breathe oh my god that was the very last thing that I was expecting <laughs> I said if we find one Rise of the Beast figure, then I would be happy. We would have, we would have a good hunt if I, if, if, if I just found one. And they left the freaking, the chart. Hasbro, it's called a trend pod. I now know what to call it. It's not a standee. I knew it wasn't a standee. The standees are the stuff at the movie theater. This is a trend pod. Bro, I'm about to I'm about to cry. I'm about to lose my mind. I'm gonna lose my mind at Walmart. I'm gonna lose my mind at Walmart. And I'm wearing. <laughs> I'm so sorry, y'all. Y'all want to see the figures, and I'm freaking out. Bro, Cheetor, freaking Nightbird. The smaller. This is the smaller. The flex changers. Bro. Oh my freaking goodness. Literally the last thing I was expecting. I was hoping to find one. There's actually more too. <laughs> but I was actually hoping to find just one Rise of the Beast thing. And we got a whole freaking trend pod. Scan the QR code for more info. Mirage. This is so surreal. Like so surreal. The fact that we finally made it for another one. Like, that is, that is insanity. Let's go over the the regular stock first, and then we're and then we're gonna hand and then that. <laughs> um, even the regular stock is sick. It's not the brand new stuff, but it's still like a lot of stuff like I thought it would have. I was only just expecting this. <laughs> None of that. Oh my god, bro. I'm not over it. I got Twitch, Bumblebee, Megatron, B, Legacy Deluxes, Velocitron, the plushies, Coronation, your mom, this, some court glasses, leader um, thing, uh, G axis. Who's that back there? Oh, another Coronation, your mom. More Coronation, your mom's. That's essentially it. I can't, I, I have to catch my breath. Man, oh my God. I just wasn't expecting to see it here. I didn't think we would be that rapid on the trend. <laughs> so we've got the flex changers, the lineup, Cheetor. We've got freaking Nightbird, Bumblebee. Oh my God, I can't believe I'm covering this right now. <laughs> Primal and uh, Arrow Stripe. It's the Beast Alliance line. That's actually what the movie was titled at first. The placeholder or tentative title was Transformers Beast Alliance until it actually officially became Rise of the Beasts. So this is the line that followed. RC and, and uh, Silver Fang, Bumblebee and uh, Snarl Saber, freaking Skull Cruncher <laughs> and Primal. Like things I've seen in the promo images, things I've reported on. They're not official renders anymore. They're not just renders, they're in hand. This is also a thing. You buy two Transformers Hasbro toys and you get a $10 reward. I saw this, this was from Fandango. So I think this is gonna be in effect. I don't know if it's in effect already, but it's gonna be in effect. So they're like incentivizing people for purchasing their stuff. More Beast Alliance figures. This is the mainline stuff, obviously, not the studio series yet, but this is a phenomenal sign, and I am extremely tempted <laughs> to cop this. I shouldn't do this. I shouldn't, but I'm probably gonna, because why not, you know? Like, why not? Bumblebee, Beast Alliance. It's just, it's, it's, it, it, it's all of this for me. You know, it's the presentation for me. It's been 25 minimum purchase, two participating Hasbro toys. Take a photo and then receipt as proof. Upload to website, scan a QR code and then redeem it. <sighs> Incentivizing fans. Look at this QR code, bro. Look at this QR code, bro. Ah, uh, this is the Beast Alliance 2, I think. Is this Beast Alliance or, oh, Smash Changers. 
I don't think it's, I'm not sure if it's Beast Alliance. My God, wow. Well, there y'all go. Um, something I 100% was not expecting is 100% in front of us. I'm definitely gonna wait until Studio Series for my personal lineup for my own stuff. I want the Studio Series Rise of the Beasts. There's only a few of the main line that I might get, like the Optimus I might check out. Not really feeling the lack of paint in the below waist section, but I might check them out. And then also the the mainline Mirage, kind of pulling me. It's gonna be like the Deluxe, I think. I do think my permanent is gonna be the Studio Series Mirage. I'm not too sure, because I kind of like the robot mode of the mainline. It looks more like that, <laughs> and less like a giant car converted to a robot. So we'll see, we'll see. I'm gonna back up. Like this was the first thing I, the first thing I saw was Prime. When I turned the corner, <laughs> I lost my mind, dude. Wow. Transformers is, has taken over all of this. All of this. Take over. This is the year that we take over. But yeah, that's pretty much um, what they've got. I'm gonna move this out the way because this is I want all of this when they're done. Like, they better not get rid of any of this. At least give me this. <laughs> With the Autobot logo. Man, that's so sick. Yo, there's more. Transformers Movie 7 Flex Changer. Sure, <laughs> there's more. That's not even it. They have overstock. <laughs> like, they're not done. I wonder if they have Studio Series in here. Yo, if they have the Studio Series. I'd freaking lose it. Movie 7, roleplay, converting, mask. Voyager class. Core BOI. Voyager class? Are there Voyager class for those? It, or is that a studio series Voyager class? Do I go to another store? I mean, can anything else beat that? That's like literally what is being reported nationwide. Right there, that's it. <laughs> I found it. I'm probably gonna get that mask for Optimus Primal. It's probably the one thing I'm gonna leave with because I just I just feel like I have to do it. It's just like it's kind of like a meme now. It's like it's kind of like a joke. It's meant for kids, but it's a joke now. It's like it's like a meme. We're gonna go to another one for whatever reason. <laughs> Look at that! Look at that! Ah. I don't want to leave. Actually, I'm gonna be honest. I, I don't want to leave. I want to just soak this in because this is this took many years to get to this. Where like, we got a new movie and it's actual like marketing in the real world. Not just among our fandom, but like the public. I don't know, it just feels awesome. I don't, I'm sorry, I just, I can't get over that. <laughs> and then Optimus front and center, dude. Bro. Holy crap, dude. Oh my God, man. That was the biggest surprise of the day. I mean, the very last thing I was expecting was to literally see the full-on trend pod for Transformers Rise of the Beast smack dab. As soon as I turned that corner, I, my heart almost dropped, like, into my foot. It was insane. It just looked so good, and it's so freaking refreshing to see a Transformers movie display on a retail, you know, like a retail end cap. That's just that's something I'm not used to see like you don't see it all the time it's been so long so many years and so that really did hit home for me big time it is beautiful all of the different figures there the mainline stuff we didn't get to see the mainline deluxes and the voyagers so i'm gonna definitely be taking a close look at this location going forward i'm gonna be going back because i want to see if they're gonna stock more of the mainline stuff and even the studio series stuff because this place got all the new stuff first so this is gonna be a really nice target going forward but holy crap that is just that is that is the most satisfying thing today and i'm so glad we found that holy crap that was awesome y'all better drop a like on this video just for that <laughs> all right so we pretty much don't have to do anything else but that but i decided to go to another store just for the sake of it so we're gonna go ahead and head to another store we're gonna do a target this time since we've hit walmart twice target is is pretty big too and they get really good distribution we're just gonna check it out we pretty much have established the meat and bones with that 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 walmart we just visited but by all means let's go ahead and check out the next door of the hunt oh yeah right. 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 imagine 
Imagine knockout transforms like right when I do that. Y'all, what the heck was that? Wow, wow, wow. That is freaking insanity. We actually freaking located it. Like that's absolutely crazy. I wasn't expecting to see that in town. The distribution in my city, as y'all have known from history, has been pretty wild. And I don't know why. Like, I'm not controlling this. It's just showing up all the time. <laughs> but anyways, we're baby. We're, we're here really honestly just because. Because I don't think Target's going to have the standee. But then again, I didn't think Walmart was going to have the standee. <laughs> So I don't know what's in here, but I'm here nevertheless to conclude the hunt once and for all. And uh, just to see what's here, I don't, I don't expect much. I think we have reached the peak of what we're gonna find today already. But this is just another like, just like, like a topping, you know, like pizza, when you have pizza. We already got our pepperoni, which is like the base, right? You can put other stuff, but we got the essential pepperoni. So this is just like the other little, little lanyard that you throw in there to make it even more flavorful but we already got our base and it's crazy i was initially not gonna hunt today because i just unboxed a figure planet actually make supreme i was gonna chill and i said you know what it's a nice day it's nice and crispy air let's go check it out and we ran into peak <laughs> tarjay Baby, walk on the target. I don't have any predictions for this door. I really don't know, <laughs> to be honest. Literally anything can happen because look, look what just happened. Oh, they ransacked this place. <laughs> like, was there a sale? That's what, that's DC. They ransack this place. Dude, they jit, like for real emptied this place. Target had a clearance. Feels like the holiday season. Dungeons and Dragons. And it's a half off sale too. But anyway, that's this is what just this is the chaos that we just walked up on. But there y'all go. I had a feeling this place would not have much. But hey yo, scrap hook in the book take a look everybody want a, a, a coffee nook <laughs> who is that back there needle nose we got needle to the nose if you want to strike a pose if you know how it goes break down don't frown this is how we play around hey i just realized i didn't drop any bars in this hunt that's not okay we can't have a hunt without bars like the the bars is most of the hunt <laughs> you you actually join for the bars and the figures are like second place. <laughs> anyway, that's uh, pretty much what we're working with. It's not much, I just wanted to show you guys. We do have the Nest Autobot Ratchet, Buzzworthy, 96. Freaking cool, I love this repaint, really nice. I like to see Scrap Hook. I actually like his, like him as a figure just generally. I love his alt mode. It's like he has elements from like a bunch of other, he's got the little hitch for like like battle trap he's got the bumpers like scorch <laughs> he's got these little um i forgot what you call them but it's on a hood it's like a drop cake and shatter he just has like a nice blend of cool tactical design i like him we got sludge down there and we got coronation your mother this is terrific comedy and we got uh we got with trying for legacy Wheelie for core class, we got Galvatron. Galvatron, ladies and gentlemen, for Transformers Age of Extinction. Cool to see him. That's a restock for sure. And we got Metal Hawk. We got three Metal Hawks, which is freaking cool to see because Metal Hawk is an awesome figure. I love his jet mode, love his robot mode. He's awesome. We dig it, we dig it. No Tarn, surprisingly. Actually, no, that's not surprising. <laughs> Tarn wouldn't last in here. I only have a Tarn because I ordered him online. I've yet to see him in retail in my city. Got Twitch and Megatron behind her. Still no Earthrise Prime? Earthrise Prime. I keep saying Earthrise. <laughs> they keep... I hate that. It's like they're so close. Earthrise, Earthspark. Earthrise, Earthspark. Okay, Earthrise, 
Optimus Prime. I said it again. Oh my God. Earth Spark. Earth Spark. Earth Spark. Earth Spark. The spark of the earth. The spark of the earth. I have yet to see Earth Spark Optimus Prime. I don't know. I just, the two things just get mixed up in my head. But I haven't seen him. And I don't, I don't know. I'm kind of debating getting him. I'm considering it. If I get anything for Earth Spark, he would be my first figure, like my entrance. That's the uh, stock. Just want to show you guys, and that's pretty much it, guys. We reached a peak. I already knew that what we just saw at Walmart was going to be the peak, but I wanted to come here anyway, just to add some more toppings to the pizza. You know what I'm saying? I I, I would probably say when Rise of the Beast does shows up, it's probably going to take over this. This is going to be the section. I'm going to make a prediction. Whenever Rise of the Beasts, when they do the end cap promotion for Rise of the Beasts, it'll be here. So just remember, like the back of the store, it'll be right here. Because this is like the like the rotating display. They did Wakanda Forever here when that movie was out. Now it's Mario movie because that movie is out. I predict Rise of the Beasts is going to be here. And I can't wait for it. If it's not here, they'll probably just attach it to the actual section like Walmart did, which would probably make more sense if they get the entire trend pod. There you go, I got it. People throw away your trash, my God. But anyway, they might fill up this section if it's not the other section. This is my second place prediction. That's pretty much it. Hope y'all enjoyed this toy hunt as much as I enjoyed it. Man, I said, I have to get out. I gotta get out and go check out things in life. And I'm glad I did. My God, I lost it. Man, I lost it. And like y'all didn't really get to see the full movement because I was holding the camera. If I had someone that was holding the camera, you would see how much I was flailing around <laughs> like a freaking, like I'm on fire. But I just love it. This is like my passion. The movie stuff is where is my realm. That's where I started. Movie stuff is my thing. So when I see movie stuff, live action, live action movie stuff specifically. Animated too, but live action is where I started. So that's it y'all. I'm gonna go ahead and conclude it off here Hope y'all enjoyed this hunt if you did smash a like on it If you're new subscribe more hunts on the way because we haven't gotten any studio series rise of the beast stuff yet So that we got to get our hands on so that's it. Hope y'all enjoyed it Thanks for watching. This is your teletran toy hunter and I will catch you all in the next one till all R1 and if you don't know now, you know roll out